All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to episode two. As you just saw from that video, I did lose that Spanish mackerel, but it's all right. We got a bunch of coral trout and we're just at this island right now. What we're gonna do is we're gonna cook it up. I'm gonna do a barbecue and it should be pretty good. All right, we just shot this coral trout about 30 minutes ago. We're gonna cook it up and I'm gonna do pretty much the same thing as in the last video. I'm gonna scale it, gut it, and then we're gonna put it on the barbecue for you guys. All right, so you just grab the tail and just scale up the fish like that. It's a pretty easy job. All right, now that we've scaled it, we're gonna do the same thing like last time. Put it straight through the back fin here. Just drag it all the way through to this fin. Then once you've reached that fin, just flick those two back like that and just dig down until you meet about halfway, just like that. As you can see, all the guts are pretty much right there. And then you can just pull them out and there you have it. All right, then as you can see, it's all pretty much out. Pretty much ready to go on the barbecue. Just gonna wash it up and then we're gonna put all our ingredients in it. All right, now that your fish is all clean and everything, uh, time to put all the ingredients in. Ah! All right, now that the fish is cleaned, what you want to do is just put some lemon and butter inside, and that's what we like to do. And make sure there's no plastic on the lemon. Um, slice it up like that, and then just chuck it on the inside of there. Just like that. Then what you're gonna do is just get all your salt and pepper and other things. I just got salt, pepper, and I'm not sure what this. And then I've got some garlic, pepper, and lemon, herb, and garlic seasoning. So what you're gonna want to do is oh. just put a bit of it on each side, just like this. All right, after you've put everything on, cut it up, and that's pretty much what it should look like. And now it's ready to go into the barbecue. All right, you can just wrap up your end, slightly cover it, and then, and then it's pretty much ready, and you just place it into the barbecue like that, and it's about 15 minutes per side, and then yeah. All right, now while I wait for that fish to cook, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna chuck in those clips from earlier before, us shooting the coral trout and all that stuff. Get the drone in the air as well, and it'll be good. I'll see you when the fish is done. Fish, bro? I think so. Ew! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's like my twitch. No, that's the eating size. This way eats. Sure, that's it.
right, so I hope you guys enjoy that little edit. Um, the food's still cooking and probably about halfway done. Still got a while. Um, and yeah, we're just chilling at the moment. It's honestly just a beautiful day and the water is crystal clear. Everyone's just chilling over there. Everyone's getting pretty sunburnt right now. But yeah, overall, it's pretty amazing. All right, so we're just eating the fish now. It tastes bloody great. What do you guys think? That's wow. amazing. Delicious. Good, good. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we just finished all that coral trout up. It was honestly amazing. Um, and now we're probably just gonna head back on the boat. We might try a bit of trolling or try to get something. And yeah, I'll just see you guys when back out there or something happens. Peace. All right, what's going on guys? We just got back. This is what we ended up getting today. We got two crayfish, a bunch of coral trout and a cod. Overall, pretty good day. I was pretty happy with that. Um, so that's probably going to be it for this video. Next video, we're going out to the reef. So if you enjoy the video, like, share, and comment. And we'll see you next time. Peace.